Common Core isn't the problem. The problem is that the people teaching our kids math spent more on their education than they're going to make in 16 years. So then, there's this. Calculus. That's where I clocked out in math. What's that, ninth grade? I don't know. I'm not good at remembering numbers. You know? But you know who's worse than me with numbers? The online dad who keeps getting mad at the schools for teaching Common Core math and post about it all the time. First off, it's new math, not Common Core, okay? And second, wait, that's addition. I don't want to throw a bunch of fancy numbers at you, angry dad. The fact that you can't help your kid with his fourth grade math does not mean that new math is stupid. It means you are. Listen, all, to all you people who think that new math is ridiculous, and there are more of you than can count, I really want to find the words to explain to you that this is a more evolved way of learning math. It's hard. I mean, I know you hate word problems. Here's some basic math for you, all right? Old math plus test scores equals dumb U.S. kids unable to compete in a global market. And my own rigorous math-based study performed here at the Simmons Institute found that 60% of all the people complaining about new math failed math at least three times. Another 40% of the complainers only passed because they cheated off the person next to them and the loudest complainers didn't know what was wrong with that joke. <laughs> all new math does is teach kids how to calculate answers in their heads by visualizing sets of numbers. There's far too many parents in this country that are furious at it being taught. They're like, why should we be relying on expert educators and how the mind actually works to solve math? Look, I barely graduated high school. Shouldn't I be the one that's listened to on this subject? Seriously, I'm just happy that I wasn't your math teacher because your ignorance is so frustrating they would have fired me for smacking you in the head with a slide rule on day two. Here's an idea. Just accept that your greatest mathematical accomplishment was back in ninth grade when you managed not to put your own eye out with the protractor. Can I say that? Is that okay to say? Hey, if you like this video, subscribe here and join my revolution. Right? It's a nonviolent revolution. There's no guns, but there is yelling.